بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم اسٹوڈنٹس آئی ایم یور آئی ٹی ٹیچر شاہد علی خان اینڈ ٹوڈے آئی ول ڈسکس اباؤٹ ایف بی آئی ایس سی پیپر پیٹرن آف کمپیوٹر سائنس فار کلاس ایچ ایس ایس سی ون اینڈ دس پیپر پیٹرن از ایپلیکیبل فرام So let's see what we have in this new paper pattern for computer science. Step by step, it has total marks 75 in computer science paper of class 11 or HSSC1 and section A has 15 MCQs and MCQs multiple choice questions included from all chapters and topics. It means that all 15 MCQs included amongst the all chapters prescribed by federal board syllabus for the computer science. So let's see move towards the next section. That is section B and it has 18 marks. And which chapters it covered in section B? We have some specific chapters reserved for section B or section B is only included uh, in these chapters. So number one, chapter number one, that is overview of computer system. Chapter number two, computer memory. Chapter number three, central processing unit. And chapter number four, inside system unit. These four chapters included in section b and section b has 18 marks so how could we get 18 marks you have to attempt any six parts from the given questions and all parts carry equal marks it means you have to attempt six questions that means each question have three marks it means six multiplied by three is equal to 18 so you will get 18 marks by attempting six question and each question have six marks let's move towards the next section next section is section c and it has also 18 marks and it covers these chapters i will discuss one by one uh, chapter number five network communication protocol chapter number six wireless communication and chapter number seven database fundamentals and in the last chapter number eight database development these four chapters are included in section c and section c has 18 marks or how could we get 18 marks you have to attempt any six questions or six parts from the given questions and all parts carry equal marks it means that all part have three marks and you have to attempt six questions that means six multiplied by three is equal to 18 so in this way you will get 18 marks in section c of computer science hssc one paper so let's move towards the next section that is section c a uh, section d sorry and this one the last section and section d has 24 marks and which chapters included in section D and uh, all chapters are included in section D there is no restriction for any chapters all chapters it means all syllabus included in section D and it has 24 marks and how could we uh, get 24 marks in section D you have to attempt any three parts or any three questions amongst the given questions and all parts or all question carry equal marks. It means all question have eight marks and you have to attempt three questions. That means it will have 24 marks. So in this way, you can get 24 marks in section D. I hope students that you have understood about the HSSC computer science paper pattern that is applicable for 2021. It means that you have to attempt that paper in upcoming year of 
federal board exam if you have any question you can ask so in the upcoming new video we will discuss more about computer science hssc1 so until that allah hafiz i'm going to signing out